Commandos, at ease. This Colonel Vikram Dev Mahapatra, who takes pride in commanding the civilian army, take out your mobile phones and type a message to your families that today from 18th April 2100 hours till the last breath of your life you will not have a thought around hatred around a race, a colour, a nationality or a religion because the mission you're about to set out on cannot be mixed with any other emotion here. That's a direct order. Now you listen, you guys. I don't know. It's been a while since I've been out of the academy. But I'll tell you this much. I might not be the man who came out of the academy, but if I see you fall to that, I swear to God, I can still take a flamethrower and burn you completely. Traditionally, we Indians love the battle. But we don't go to war because we want to conquer lands out there. We've been to war to fight the greater evil. Whether it was the two great world wars, 1,50,000 brave soldiers sacrificed their lives fighting with the rulers. And we have an India gate on Rajpath which stands as a tribute. I wonder how many Indians know that. We don't recognize them as heroes. While we were the biggest reason both the wars were won by the Allied forces. Now we have another war which is right here. It's at our doorstep. It's in every water droplet which could exist on any surface around. 2020, it's the Corona War. Now, I don't care whether you're from Agartala, you're from Trivandrum, you're from Mehsana, you're from Barampur, or you're from Tanjavur. I want you to know, as Indians and ex Indians who live across the border, who fought those two wars too. And every race out there which exists, we're going to come together and remind ourselves that this planet is our home. There's only one country, it's called planet Earth. There's only one family, it's called mankind. Together, we're going to remind ourselves and put this little microbe to where it belongs, which is to rot in hell. Now, I don't know. I've heard this bunch. I've heard this bull crap that I want to die for my country. And then I've heard this other bull crap over the years that this all talk about dying for your country is absolute bull sugar. Make the other man die for his country. Now, I'll tell you, there can't be bigger stupidity than that. In 2020, there is only one army. It's called mankind. There's only one enemy. It doesn't recognize nationality, race, color, sex, gender, nothing of the sort. 
30 to 40 years from now, when you are sitting with your grandkids and your grandkids ask you, Grandad, what were you doing in 2020 when the coronavirus hit the planet? I don't want you to say that you were shoveling shit out of Ludhiana. Is that clear? Dismissed.